I first started riding when I was probably about five. I have an older brother and whatever he did, I wanted to do. And fortunately, him and as well as my father were always big advocates of me getting on two wheels and, and riding right alongside him. All growing up, our family vacations revolved around motorcycle events. So I've been going to Daytona since I was old enough to walk. Um, that's what we always did. It was, you know, my dad's business and he would, my mom, my sister and brother and I would all come along and we would make it a family vacation. So our family literally eats, sleeps and breathes motorcycles from the day I was born. My daughter Jody is very much involved. She works with me every day. Jody has made such a name for herself and she's the youngest person ever to be inducted into the Hall of Fame. Jody is smart, she's extremely brave, she's talented, and when she decides she's going to do something, she does it all the way. She always gives it 100%. I could not go up there and, uh, and do the introduction. I would never have made it through. But uh, her Aunt Bibi did a great job introducing her, and uh, she's uh, well deserved of it. So this is really an honor and a privilege to be up here among so many great names in this industry. And I'm truly humbled standing here. I wouldn't be here without so many wonderful people in my life. My mom, who has taught me manners and to be polite, but my dad is who taught me to have a passion for two wheels. So if you think that I'm wicked nice, Thank my mom. If you think that I can ride a motorcycle, thank my dad and maybe my brother Jesse. Well, there's the two most proudest moments uh, were today was probably one. And the second, which is equally the same, is when she went 200 miles an hour at the Bonneville Salt Flats in Utah. And she became the first woman in history to ever go over 200 on an American bike. There are so many people who have helped me achieve my goals and given me great experiences, from going 200 miles an hour on the salt flats to riding antique motorcycles across the country, to going in circles on old bikes with no brakes and no gears. I truly love everything that I am able to do. This is our 11 bomb at the 2020 Perowitz Paint Show with my good friend Jody. Jody, congratulations. Thank you. This is a trophy for Jody. We did it just for Jody because she's very special to us. And uh, I just want to say congrats. I'm going to keep going, <laughs> I'm going to keep climbing.